here today we look at 18 if episode 10 by the way i apologize my doors in the background's uh, open i know some people get pissed off when I ha- that happens but um i kind of have to do it because if you can also tell my poster behind me fell so i gotta retape it up and yeah i don't want it to be hanging at the moment and right now i'd rather do the review first and then fix that later but anyways this week's episode 18 if was very odd to say the least but it also brought us some interesting questions. So we meet this girl named Jane Doe, which, I mean, if, if anyone doesn't realize, Jane Doe is just a pseudo name. It's not really an actual name. It's given to people who don't typically have a name, just like John Doe. Um, but apparently she is a writer. And what's interesting of this week's episode is that she is really into her dream world. Like, she does it, she's not doing it to attack people like some of the other witches are. She's doing it just because she wants a place of freedom. She wants some place that she can have, I guess, her zen in for the most part. But the problem is, is that I think she's taking it a little too far. And she's been trapped in this, this dream world to the point that she just would rather reside there and only come out of it once in a while. You know, as the grandmother says, apparently she does get out of it. She does wake up at night, you know, eats food, etc., and goes back to sleep. But it's not healthy, so, you know, that's why Haruto and the professor were sent to kind of help her out. Now, what's interesting, though, is that the week's episode, you know, had a whole bunch of this weird different art style, which I didn't like at first, but it kind of grew on me. I started digging it at one point. I still think it's very weird that, like, at 10 minutes in, around that, roughly, they started dancing. Well, Haruto wasn't dancing, but the um, his, his quote-unquote sister and the professor started dancing to this really good song in the background. And I'm like, Why? <laughs> Why is this happening? I'm, I'm very confused. Um, but it was it was a solid episode on the list. It was very interesting to see. Now, I do think that the biggest takeaway from this week's episode, though, was the very last statements we got before the episode ended. So, the professor asked Jane Doe, because, you know, we really don't know her re- real name is, though, you know, what, what happened with Haruto, and more so asked asked her what he she can do about him being asleep because she had asked him how long has he been asleep for so far and all the professor said was I'm going to eventually need your help in that and she goes okay so I'm very I'm thinking that eventually we're going to get not to the sleeping beauty part but Haruto is going to be the one who also has to be kind of waking up out of his dream or woken out of his dream because of the fact that he's been in there way too long and we still don't know why I'm very curious like what is the purpose and I hope the only thing I would kind of get kind of irritated with is if he's also a girl like secretly he's been a girl this whole time that would be weird because I'd be like come on the, the, the game didn't have that you know don't don't change too much about the character uh, that'd be very strange to me but you never know I, I'm very curious what they're gonna do with this uh, just because think about it you know last week's episode he ha- he was basically a girl in that whole thing and I get that the whole thing was the idols can't be dudes but don't you think that's kind of weird that he fit the role of a girl like almost too too well that's what i want to know like what is he really a girl I, that's i hope not i really i'm just saying i hope not because i think it would just be a kind of odd twist that i can see coming from a mile away if they actually did that and i don't want that to be the case so i'm just hoping that there's another reason he's knocked out and he's just unable to wake up but anyways, what did you guys think about this week's episode? I would love to hear from you down below in the comments. As always, if you'd like to my reviews, you know what to do. I'll talk to you later. God bless you all. Hopefully you're all safe and sound, guys. Bye-bye, everyone.